welcome back to a new video in today's video it's it's a little bit different this video but it's not really it's still a set of nails but i've got a box here to show you it, it did arrive a little bit beaten up and bruised up beaten up and bruised up beaten up but that was nothing to do with the company that was to do with the delivery service um i have opened the items inside because i couldn't wait i wanted to have a look so they didn't arrive like that <laughs> i did actually open them here i've got I was like, I didn't know whether to just show you one item at a time. And then I, d I was like, oh, no, I'm just going to show them everything. So what I plan to do is do a set of nails inspired by each of these items. So the first items here, I was like, which one shall I show you? Oh, I also like that they have. I'm pretty sure they're an American company, which is why they've got these. They've got these little like location stickers. I don't know what you want to call them. Like kind of thing you'd see on luggage with different like what are they called different places in america which i thought was quite cute also i love that i'll get i'll get to the point in a minute i was like what shall i show you first oh how shall i do this i was going and i was like right no just sod it right i love that these these are actually phone cases okay oh and there's something else in the other paper envelopes as well but i love that the phone cases come in these really cute like felt envelopes you could reuse them easily um i thought that was a nice touch so this first one i've got is a, a glitter ombre phone case it's also got crystals on the side which i love i uh, in my opinion you can't go wrong with a bit of glitter and a bit of crystals a bit of crystals a few crystals it is textured so it's textured on the back so obviously if, if you don't like textured phone cases this one probably won't be for you but i absolutely bloom and love it i can definitely do a set of nails inspired by this absolutely also imagine you've got your phone in there right you don't want to take like your massive bag but look oh you could keep it in there just to protect your phone for like i don't know like a a little night out or something i don't know i'm not very good at nights out and stuff i don't do that anymore <laughs> this one i had to get this one because it's a marble also they do again they do different colored uh, marbles i think they've got a few different color marbles they've also got a different colored glitter ombre one as well i just chose these ones the blue one reminded me of the sea so i was like oh i like that one i'll have that one and also this one if you zoom in it's got little bits of holographic glitter in it as well which I really liked. And this one is smooth, so you're not gonna get any, obviously when it's on your phone, you're gonna feel no, no like, no texture on it. Also, this one is clear. So if you've got a dark phone, the marble might not show up as much. Um, it, uh, yeah, it's, it's only showing up a lot because it's got that white paper in it. So yeah, do, do bear that in mind. I will show you pictures of my phone in the phone case when I do the set of nails for that phone case. But at the moment, because my phone, I use my phone to record, so it's a little bit awkward. But I'll sort something out and I will put images of my phone in the phone case as I, you know, when I when I come to doing that video. Um, these are oh, cute little AirPod like holder things. I had to get the Nutella one. <laughs> Do you know what i'm not i'm not gonna lie i'm not a massive fan of nutella but my kids rave about nutella and i just thought it was blooming cute i absolutely loved it i am always losing my airpods so it's going to be quite nice to have them in something that makes them a little bigger do you know what i mean um they fit in there really snugly i did manage to get it out but i didn't want to faff around on the camera also they've they've got those look you oh hang on i'll show you on this one They've got those little carabiner clasps. This one was a cow print. I absolutely love cow print designs. I don't know what it is about cow print designs. I just love them. So this one, I'm not going to get my on my AirPods out to put them in this one because this one, this one was even more snug to get them in. Look how cute they are. That one's the wrong way around. There we go. That's better. So uh, yeah, so you got the carabiner clips as well. So you could clip them to belt loop belt loop on your jeans or something or your bag maybe not your bag because someone might nick them but you know what i mean you can hook them somewhere so you won't lose them yes this one is the i'm gonna do the cow print today you will have seen the thumbnail anyway 
So we're going to do some Moo Moo print nails. Also, look, I've got different paper. I don't like it. I need my Blitz paper. My Regina Blitz paper. I need it. There we go. Look, so that's what it would... Ta-da! Pretend the AirPods are in there. So this is the one we're going to use today. Right, the gel polish I have is from Madame Glam. I've got Perfect Black. I have got Soft Pink. That's going to be our nail bed colour. And then for the free edge colours, we're going to use Lil Chick and Pause Up. So these are the these are the colours from Easter. That was the Easter kind of set that they released. Collection, sorry. Uh, Pastel Dream and Sea Life, which is the blue one. So I do have discount codes for things today. Um, I've got a 10% off code for you for Case Nova Club. Did I tell you they were from Case Nova Club? I might not have done. So the, the, the phone cases in the airport, they do other stuff as well. They do, um, what are they called? They do Apple Watch, Apple Watch bands. Um, they do, you know, they, they, they're called, I can't think what they're called, but Apple do them now. You can put them on your keys so you don't lose your keys. Air tags or something they're called. They do little holders for those as well. Yeah, so anyway, it's from Case, um, Case Nova Club. Uh, I'll leave the website. The, I'll, I've got a, a link down. I'll leave the link down below. And also, I've got a 10% off code for you, NatMug10. Go and have a look because, honestly, they've got some really cute stuff. They are on Instagram as well, I think. Yeah, they're on Instagram. They're definitely on Instagram. Um, so I'll put that in the description box as well. And you can go and have a nosy. Right, I've got my Nail Sugar Natalie Mug Ridge Detailer Brush for this because... It's just the best brush in the whole wide world. And I know I'm using like pastel colours, but because we're we're in summer, I know the weather's in the UK has been absolutely pants the last I want to say the last couple of weeks. It's been shite, hasn't it? Excuse my language. It's been poop. Um hopefully it'll brighten up. Though to be fair, I'm not a fan of the heat, so I don't really mind. <laughs> I know I'm terrible. The so with the with the, uh, with the brush, I've just marked out the smile line and then I'm going to take the brush from the bottle just to fill in most of that free edge area just to save time. And if you make a mess, if you've got a clean up brush or something, just sort of tidy it up. And then I will just go over it again with my detailer brush just to, if there's any, you can do two coats. I don't want to do two coats. So I'm just making sure that it's covered nicely and there's no sort of patchy bits to be honest if you do get patchy bits it's not going to be the end of the world because we are going to put the anim the cow print on so you can cover like the patchy bits with the cow print when i do the next one i hold it next to the first one that i've done just to mark out where the smile line how fast down the smile line goes i did make this a little bit it's a little bit smaller than the first one but you know it's not the end of the world and then I'm literally going to repeat the process. Where's my... I've got a latte. <laughs> I feel so posh. And my other half bought... Right, he's a coffee. He's coffee mad. He bought these, like, proper... You know the co You know coffee? People... And the adverts, you see people with coffee in clear, clear cups. He's got, like, like glass... Like, glass see-through cups for the coffee. And I feel really posh. I don't know why. It's, it's, only, a, it's only a clear glass cup. <laughs> I'm such a weirdo. Oh, I think it makes it taste better as well. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm being a, being a silly billy. So yeah, so look, again, I'm filling in that section. I'm just going over it with my detailer brush just to make sure that it's there's no patchy bits. There we go. Making sure they kind of, you know, I mean, they're not awfully, they're not too different, so I'm not going to panic too much, but there we go. I will go ahead now and do, I'll do the same on this one. And again, I always mark it off that first one. I don't know why I just kind of do it might not be so easy if it's on a proper hand I don't know <laughs> but there we go right we're going to carry on with the other nails and then I'm going to go over with the velvet matte top coat we haven't finished yet don't panic but I want to seal this in because the cow print we're going to make it slightly textured like slightly embossed I love doing you've seen me do this millions of times but I'll show you in a second but firstly we need to go over with the velvet matte top coat make sure you've covered the whole nail especially like when I'm doing tips I know it's going to be a little bit different on a client but make sure that you get down the side walls because sometimes 
I concentrate too much on the top and I forget the sides. Like I do the sides, but there's like a couple of little bits. So yeah, I just have to make sure that I get the sides, but you'll notice in a minute, I do just quickly check the sides here. Do I? Oh, I did anyway. <laughs> And then we're going to use the Perfect Black. I do have a 30% off code from Adam Glam as well. It's NatMug30. It's, it's, it, yeah, I like to stick to NatMug and then whatever. NatMug10 is, is a lot of them. Anyway, right. I tried to copy roughly. It didn't, it didn't work out. But I was, initially I was like, right, I'm going to try and copy that, the, the actual pattern on the, on the case. But because the... Yeah, it didn't, it, I don't know. I ended up changing it up a little bit. But all the other nails I done completely different as well. But it's still like a cow print, you know. Moo moo print. A moo moo. <laughs> That's a posh cow. A moo moo. <laughs> I don't know what's up with me today. <coughs> By the way, I apologise for not posting yesterday. This probably should have gone up yesterday. I just didn't have any videos ready and I did do a set of nails yesterday but I ended up not liking it and I just I don't want to put up rubbish that I don't like so I yeah I ended up doing some more nails yesterday uh, this was one of them and I thought you know what it's Monday let's just take a breather today and I will upload a video on Wednesday instead to make up for missing out on yesterday so yeah oh yeah look look we're pouring acrylic over the uncured black gel polish i'm going to show you i'm going to show you me doing it on this one as well because i totally missed i was like not talking to you about that but right on this one i'm making the i'm just randomly placing the the cow print on i also like to do this bit i don't think i mentioned it with a probably because i was talking about something stupid <laughs> with a with a dotting tool or this is i'm using the end of a crystal picker upper i just find it's a lot easier to make this random pattern using a dotting tool than a brush because you can really just yeah you can really just you know make some funny patterns not funny patterns but it's, it's sort of very irregular isn't it this one i'm sorry if you can hear noises outside there we go and then again I'm going to put the acrylic on, make sure that the, what's going to happen is the gel polish will suck in that acrylic and then it will start to go shiny again. So if it starts to go shiny again, just pour on a little bit more acrylic and don't put the, don't put the nail in the lamp until it's completely matte. And what happens is you get this kind of embossed, raised matte, you can't really see it on the video. But it just, it just gives it a little bit more, it just gives it a bit of dimension. So, oh, it's so noisy. There we go. So we're this far. We're nearly there, right? I'm going to add some crystals. Only on a couple of the nails. And I'm only going to add a few. These are from Nail Sugar's Crystal Boutique section of the website. These are the AB crystals with the foil backs. So I'm just going to put a little bit up by the cuticle area. And I put my, I put my gem glue on. And all I'm going to do is put three little crystals along the top. And then two underneath that. And then if you look in the background there, I've got some little silver caviar beads that I will just place. I couldn't get that one off. <laughs> I'll just place like a few in between the crystals there. I'm just going to keep it simple. I don't want to go too mad because I don't want to take away from the... The, the I mean it's, it's pretty difficult to take away from it but I want the cow print to be the focus of the nails so I'm going to do that on one more nail pop that in the lamp to cure for 60 seconds and this is them finished I'll show you a little bit of a close-up with the airpod case from case nova club all the links and everything will be in the description box below go and have a look they've got some really cute stuff on the website honestly I was going to place another order the other day <laughs> And then I thought, just get these done first, because I've got, you know, it's terrible. I'm terrible. I want things all the time. It's disgusting. There we go. Anyway, I hope you liked this video. If you did, please leave me a like. If you haven't already, do consider subscribing. It is completely free. I think that's it. Yeah. Have an amazing Tuesday. And um, I'm going to show you a picture of the AirPod case. 
and our, no, AirPods, yeah, AirPods, yeah, it's AirPods, I want to say iPod, but it's not, right, love you all, bye! <laughs>